Croquet is a sport that most people have heard of, but they don't know how it actually works. One group here in the Northwoods is trying to change that. Newswatch 12's Griffin Stroin has the story. That's kind of the whole motive behind it was we just wanted a place to play and have people join us to have fun, you know. People come to the Northwoods to kayak, golf, or bike. But a group in Arbor Vita are trying to get people involved in a different sport. This game is really, it takes a lifetime really to achieve the techniques and the shots. Um, that's what's the appeal for me. Dale Hazley owns the Swift Creek Croquet Club. He fell in love with the game in Florida and knew he had to bring it to the Northwoods. So we decided to build a court uh, for ourselves here and try to uh, get other people involved in the sport. Anybody can pick up the mallet and hit the ball. Nice. The best thing about croquet is that anybody can play at any age. And once you make it to the croquet club, there are so many different levels of experience and games to play. But push come to shove, main focus, get the ball through the wicket. There's a million different combinations of hits, and it always changes every time somebody goes to a wicket, it's a different setup than the last one. So it's never boring that that way. So it's a really fun sport. <laughs> COVID-19 has hurt the business, but it is a socially distant sport. You definitely can stay apart while you're playing and uh, you're definitely out in the fresh air and the sunshine and it's a real natural setting here. Right. A natural setting that Hazley sees becoming very popular soon. Just any kind of event that a couple or people have when they come up here uh, to the North Woods and they're looking for something different to do. In Arbavita, Griffin Stroyan, News Watch 12.